Well, if you've been in downtown Boise lately, you may have noticed a really big project happening at 11th and Bannock. Once proposed as one of the sites for the transportation hub, now about to become a new sparkling office building and public park. Capital City Development Corporation, Boise Parks and Rec, and longtime Boise developer Raffinelli and Nahas broke ground on the park after nearly a decade of planning. Arkatia Stepovic has the latest now on what we can expect and when we can expect it as the landscape of downtown Boise continues to change. Katia. Yeah, that's right, Mark. As you can see by all the construction around and behind me, they're already working on getting rid of that old concrete parking lot and replacing it with something very new and exciting. It's a familiar sound if you live in downtown Boise. A familiar sight on 11th and Bannock. You may be thinking, great, another skyscraper. There's a lack of open space in our downtown area, and there's a need to make those kind of improvements. A lack of open space. So what to replace? Reaching out to the public, understanding what are the amenities that people want to see. And believe it or not, folks don't always agree on things, right? Well, the public agreed on one thing, preserving some of the outdoors while adding some dining and artwork. This parking space won't look so dull in the near future. Real estate development company Raffinelli and Nahas will create a nine-story tall office building with restaurants on the bottom level. And adjacent to that will be the public park, something Doug Woodruff with the CCDC says is not so easy to come by. Trying to find space in a, in a developed downtown area to build a park is a, is a tremendous challenge. We really view this as a, a new spot in downtown for residents, uh, city workers, and, and tourists alike to all come down and enjoy community gatherings and, and uh, even just casual lunches in the outdoor dining area. At just under a half acre, the park will have a grass event lawn, stage area, outdoor seating, and you can't miss it. The 23 foot tall gentle breeze tree structure with individual leaves that will move with the current weather patterns, bringing the West downtown a new look and a refreshing one. It's really important that we make public investments that help uh, address the growth challenges that the Treasure Valley are facing. Right now, the demand for housing is so high in, in the Boise area that making investments like this in open space that um, really provide amenities for the residents that we're seeing moving downtown to the new apartments that are being built is really important. There is no word yet on who will be taking up this space inside that office building. CCDC hopes that everything will be open by summer of 2021. Mark. Just incredible. They do this in a very, very fast pace for sure. And what a great spot it is down there, Katia. Right next to Cradle Point, you got the record exchange there, the Hyatt. That West Boise is bustling, right? Absolutely. Yeah, all right. Exciting to see. It is. Katia Stepovic reporting for us. Katia, thanks.